Aaron, you were just on the front page of the New York Times business section. Um, the article says that uh, you are basically the the person behind Facebook, the idea. Um, did the article capture exactly? Uh, is, is that the truth? I believe it's the truth, uh, and I, I believe the evidence bears that out. I think the Times did a very good job of capturing what had actually happened and the dynamics between Facebook Incorporated and Connect You in my own creation at the time, which was House System. Um, House System was, was actually a portal for Harvard students that was used by about 1,800 people by May of 2004. And a lot of those people really liked it because you could buy and sell textbooks and you could review courses and you could upload digital posters and do a lot of the things that you can actually do on Facebook today. So there are definitely some overlaps between the products. And is it resolved or not? Uh, not according to the uh, circuit court of San Jose, I believe, where right now they're battling it out between Facebook and ConnectU. So I'm not sure how that'll play out, but uh, it'll be definitely interesting to watch. What have you learned from this process or situation? Uh, well, I, I think what I said in the Times is that if you wait long enough, the truth will come out. For me, it took about four years before there were people willing to listen to the actual story, but uh, finally it, it did happen, and that was really nice. Now, others do say that, um, or I guess Mark stands by the fact that he, I guess he thinks that he did, he is the person behind the idea. Is that, what do you say to him? Have you talked to him? Um, I, I talked to Mark briefly a couple months ago, but I mean, so a lot of people are, are criticizing what the Times wrote and, and I guess criticizing me for, for making a claim to having invented social networking, but that's not really the point at all. Um, it, it's obviously been a concept that's been around for a long time, and I remember getting invitations for social networks as early as 1997, so I'm not, and I never was, trying to imply that I would ever developed that idea, but rather that for the company that is now Facebook Inc., um, and for Mark's particular iteration of the idea, that there was some influence from other people and that I was one of them. That's really what I was trying to say. How do you want it to be resolved? What would be fair? Um, I, I, I think what was proper was to have credit given where it was due, and I, I think the Times article accomplished that. Okay. Did Was there anything in the Times article that wasn't said that you wish to share? Oh, well, basically just that point that, you know, the, the claim I'm trying to stake out is not that I invented networking or anything. and. and I would never try to make a claim that grandiose, but rather that in the specific time period of, you know, I think it was from September of 2003 to then February of 2004, where that whole process took place between ConnectU and Facebook, that there was actually other stuff going on as well. So how old are you now, and did you graduate Harvard, and uh, what are you doing now? I'm 24. I graduated a year early from Harvard, so I was supposed to graduate in 2005, and I left in 2004, but I got my degree. And in what? In economics, actually. Okay. I turned out not to like their CS program very much. Um, but I'm working on a new company now called Cubescape, and it's cube with a Q, so letter Q, uh, U-V-E-S-E-A-P-E, -E, and we'll be making a Facebook for companies. So um, look out for it, and you can check it out at cubescape.com. Is it up already or is it stealth? It's neither. It's uh, it's in progress and mm -hmm. we're going to be probably launching at the end of this month, so September. Can you elaborate a little bit more what a Facebook for companies is? Not yet. Okay. <laughs> Eventually. It, it, it'll be pretty cool, I think. I'm looking forward to it launching. And what about the funding? Do you have um, funding or are you looking for any? We have a Series A round, so we're, we're pretty much set for now. I'm hoping that we don't actually need any more because I don't like spending money very much. And but, how much uh, did you raise? Uh, that I don't know if I can say. Okay. But um, yeah, so I think we're, we're well taken care of for now, and uh, we're going to have a nice Palo Alto garage for our office, so it should be a lot of fun. Great. But now you're here at the SF uh, Silicon Valley Tech Meetup, and um, you're looking for people. Are you right. hiring? We are hiring. We're looking for PHP and MySQL and Flash programmers. So if you know any of those things, you should definitely send us an email at jobs at cubescape.com. Okay. Thanks so much. Thanks a lot. And good luck. Thanks.